Welcome to our podcast, episode 82 on Ninjago. Something from my childhood. So I'm finally talking about this. Seeing that uh, I recently did like a whole rewatch slash technically first watch because some of it I never properly saw like I saw bits and pieces but yeah but yeah um, welcome to this episode um uh so yeah let's just begin that I guess uh long before time <laughs> Long before time and name, the first spinditium. How does it go? I'm trying to remember the whole speech. Uh, uh, actually, I know an easy way I can find it because I have like a. <laughs> Uh, a version, like, in a playlist that's just Hatsume Miku doing it. Long before time the name, the first spin jutsu master created a ninjago. There it is. ...Darkness <laughs> Jump up, kick back, and then another spin. Oh, I better just let it play. Jump up, kick back, kick back, and then spin. Ninja, go, ninja, go. Ninja, go, ninja, go. So we can win. Episode one, nice. Ah, uh, absolute classic, absolute. Uh, that that intro, well, never get out for me. Uh, is just you know nostalgia, my childhood. But yeah, but yeah, snakes, snake, 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 dun 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 dun, dun. wrong series. <laughs> I haven't really even played Metal Gear like that much, like, so I don't know if I'll ever do a Metal Gear, uh, our podcast until eventually playing because one game I do want to play is Metal Gear um, Rising Revengeance but anyway back to Ninjago um, uh, so it all begins with snakes and snakes are a common thing throughout the series Especially Pythor, Jesus Christ. Pythor, when will you learn that you won't win against the ninja? Like, I, I, I love a joke video where it was just like Pythor being like, oh my god, I, I've gone through this so many times. I've gone through, you know, multiple redesigns of... Went through this whole song and dance like several times and like, uh, <laughs> it, it, it's a great video. Um, I'll, I'll try and link it or it, if I can find it, but it, it's a good video. Like, Python is just done with it, but. Yeah, Ninjago. Absolutely uh, great. Very cool series. 
I kind of, I, I kind of dislike Lloyd because, like, being a fan of, like, the, the, like, pilot slash the original movie first, like, that was, you know, my introduction when Lloyd turns out to be, you know, you know, Green Ninja, I was like, this seems annoying and especially with some of the stuff that happens later, like the love stuff that Lloyd gets with uh, um, Naomi. That, that's the one, Naomi, the quiet one, yeah. Like, like, I feel like Kai got ripped off. Although, I guess, you know, the, the main character is technically always changing, like, the, the, the season focuses on each of the ninjas, you know, a different amount for each season, but I love my boy Kai. <laughs> um, but yeah, I feel like he was ripped off, um. Uh, um, uh, uh, yeah, so yeah, I've always, like, not liked Lloyd. Now I don't really care as much, but earlier, younger me did care a lot more. Like, now I don't really care, but, um, you know, past me, you know, do doesn't really like Lloyd, kind of, like, felt like Lloyd, you know, stole a show. But yeah. But, um, but there's many other villains other than Python, like the Overlord, um, um, the, the, the Time Brothers, I forget their names, um, uh, 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 lots of different, you know, villains over the series, the mechanic, uh, Others, it, it has been a little bit since my rewatch, so do bear that in mind, but yeah, um, it's a cool series, although, yeah, yeah, and it's, you know, tired towards, you know, you know, kids, because they want to sell you the Lego, which I have some <laughs> of it, so... Um, but yeah, I, I, I'm, but I'm such an old fan that I have season one before it was, you know, while well, well, I was technically counted as season two and the beginning of season two, you know, I was still like season two, like I'll show like some images as proof of like I do own like the original disc, like, where season one was, uh, you know, uh, um, still technically season two and season two, you know, like, it was the third volume of season two, but yeah, uh, yeah, where the pilots were counted as, you know, season one, but, um, yeah, I found the video, so, uh, I guess for this part, I will, uh, you know, have it as a display capture, just because I'll be easier, so, uh, here we are.
Pythor P. Chumsworth, you are invited to join the Council of the Crystal King and have your revenge upon those who have wronged you. Do you accept? I, I, I love this video. <laughs> uh, no. Excellent. Wait, what? What did you just say? No. What? I don't want to be a part of your council. I don't think you understand what I'm offering you. Oh, I completely understand. I've decided that all of this vidin stuff tends to cost more than it earns, which is one of the reasons I got involved with Bitcoin and... Wait, then how did you get into prison? <laughs> That's about Bitcoin. to tell Bitcoin. Ironic, really, No, that... no, no. I... Listen, you're going to like this. We're taking revenge against the ninja. <sighs> I'm sure you are. We're going to rule Ninjago. <laughs> yes, yes, good luck with that. I'd rather be here alone. Have fun. Then I'm afraid that if you don't join us, when we're in charge, we'll be forced Are to... we really doing this? I've been to prison, I've been eaten alive, you, your stupid cosplay mask, and your lame-ass generic villain threat don't freaking scare me. I'm not interested. Go away. We oh, you're still talking. are assembling a team of Ninjago's greatest villains. Oh, really? Like who? The Skull Sorcerer. Okay, wait, he actually sounds pretty cool. But, but we, like, we haven't asked him yet, so... Oh. You know, he, he might be booked up. Yeah, or, right, booked up. Yeah, he lives on, like, a really high mountain, like, really far away. You sound intimidated. But we also have Mr. Uh, F. I don't... I don't even know who that is. Asphira and... The poser, my god. We also invited the, uh, the, the mechanic. The mechanic! <laughs> really? The mechanic? <laughs> well, he's, like, done stuff. He tied Zane up to a chair, threatened him. Oh, you can get in the clip <laughs> so easy nowadays. <laughs> Do you realize how hard I had to work back in my day when villainy meant something? And the mechanic, really? <laughs> What's his superpower? <laughs> Overcharging for an oil change? That, look, <laughs> stop. Just stop. I've already been run around this bush three times before. We get fancy new weapons and toys and a super cool little hideout, but it never does us any bloody good. We'll also give you a redesign. I've had four redesigns in six years! I don't want another bloody redesign! What? Why do you even want me? <laughs> I'm old as frick. Every plan I've ever conceived has been blown to hell. What do you actually think I'm going to contribute? I'm marginally stronger than the average person. I can turn <laughs> invisible, and that's it. I, I mean, like, that is it. <laughs> You know, maybe this... I, I don't think that this is going to work out. Thank goodness. The Overlord's not gonna like this. Bloody who?! <laughs> I think this video was also made just before, like... Like, I think it released in two parts, so I think it released just before... Like... Uh... It was revealed that was the Overlord, but... I could be wrong. Like, but yeah, pretty good video by Foxtail. Go check them out. I'll link their channel and link the the video. Um, yeah. But yeah, back to normal. Um. Um, yeah, Ninjago, um, as things fall in the background, <laughs> uh, um, Ninjago, you know, was my childhood, but I only mean, recently, you know, got back into it, and, um, uh, it was interesting seeing everything. I also like, uh, the ending of like, like, one of the most like recent seasons was just, um, the 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 special move was basically the thing that's in the the lyrics of, you know, the the Ninjago song being you know, jump up, kick back, whip around and spin, you know. That was those moves in order to do a special move, so it, it's kind of funny. 
And one funny thing is, like, certain powers just get forgotten over time, like air jitsu. Like, that was a thing. They never use it anymore, but that was a thing. They used to exist, you know, that the ninja once, but now it's like, doesn't even matter because I'll probably just use normal spin jitsu to basically essentially fly anyway, so, you know, doesn't even really matter. Air jitsu was kind of pointless. <laughs> And some of the other special moves probably won't even be used again or like on the very oddest of occasion, but yeah. And Cole just somehow went from being ghost to on ghost. Like how? How 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 did you do this, Cole? Like I guess it's just human again. Some things don't make sense, and but yeah, again, it's not exactly always meant to make sense. But yeah, I like Ninjago a lot. So it's pretty cool, and yeah, uh, yeah. My my favorite character is probably Zane. The, the good old robot boy, uh, the, the old stuff, the old Ninja Hugger, it's quite funny. And it's so weird, you know, looking between old Ninja and then, you know, the modern Ninja where they actually seem to have a budget. <laughs> like, <laughs> like actual you know, proper models where the old models look <laughs> really <laughs> um, <laughs> not bad, but just, you know, you can tell that they're old. Um, but, um, yeah. But, yeah. Um, the Ninjago uh, is a cool series I recommend watching, but yeah, again, it's not for everyone. Saying, you know, it's mainly tied towards, you know, children, but I, I still enjoy it. Like, I, I'm still interested to see where it goes whatever they do but yeah like it's not for everyone but yeah um yeah i i think that would do it for this our podcast though ninja is cool um uh um the, the new current season with the Dimension stuff's interesting. I wonder what else they'll do with it because at time of recording it's the second half or whatever hasn't come out so yeah I just have to look out for that and um, yeah. Anyway, thank you all for watching the Our Podcast and yeah, that'll be the end of this video.